What's up, Scorpio? This is going to be my last collective reading tonight. I've been trying to do three a day when I feel good. Um, I'm going to get my walk in, my exercise, because I hadn't had a chance to do that. I kind of ended up having, you know, some stuff I had to get done today, but a little bit more of a lazy day as far as just energy. So um, it was hot. I got out a little bit, but I decided I'm going to go for my walk when it got a little bit cooler and darker outside. So... <laughs> I'm going to do a quick reading before I get into my personals. I've got a couple personals to do. Um, and then after my walk, I'm going to come back before I go to bed and probably do a live in my pajamas. We'll see. I don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. But before I go to bed tonight, we're going to do a live, hopefully, even if it's just a check in and chat, but I'm going to try for it to be definitely earlier than it was last night for sure so since it's already still I don't know what time it is a little early right now so if you like it here guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button like comment share show your love and support as always please keep it positive but most importantly help the channel grow hitting that subscribe button helps <clears throat> every time I do post a new video you be notified so Let's get into it, my loves. Let's see what's going on. I do have the pendulum out. I used it once. I haven't used it again. I keep forgetting. Um, I had it all packed up, and I love using it as a tool. Uh-oh. I just saw backstabbed and money being involved. All right, so let's make, let's 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 say let's say what we got to say uh before we get started if you would like to donate these are free readings any donations are much appreciated guys if you follow me you know i'm going through chemotherapy taking a long break right now between three to six months off from work fingers crossed it's three right now um but i am still out of work and i have been for a little over two months so please 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 anything right now would help us if you would like to donate we are kind of getting to the point where I've had to even take a break from an adverse reaction, but also just being able to afford to live and actually get the, the treatments that I need right now. So please, um, if you can afford that GoFundMe link is in the description box below. We're trying to make it through chemo chemo chemotherapy treatments again, guys. Um, and it hasn't been an easy road this time. Um, getting the kid to school, all the stuff. We've had so much going on and it's just me. I'm not married, right? So, and I don't have family here. So please, any help um, if you feel compelled to and can. Uh, that information is in the description box below. Uh, Venmo Cash App, if you'd like to donate. Again, these are just free readings if you'd like to donate for the hell of it, right? Just because you love me. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, but information for personal readings, uh, that information is in the description box below. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, what messages do we have coming out for Scorpio running? Okay, this is twice now. You've definitely got a runner or have had a runner in a situation, okay, uh, with that coming out twice. Scorpio, don't let me find out it's you. Okay. We can do that too, all right? Someone is a user or an opportunist, be careful. So the person maybe that might be running in a situation could possibly even be a user or opportunist, Scorpio. So for maybe, you know, this is coming out for a reason, right? Scorpio, maybe spirit is like, let this person run. Just let them go, baby, because it looks like they might have just been there for some money, some type of opportunity. Uh, somebody is actually going towards a workplace affair or something going on. So be open to change. We do have romance, intense connection coming in. Somebody trying to find out more about you. Uh, somebody could be looking up your name, your information online, things about you, trying to learn more about you, study you. Uh, what else? Getting your sexy back. I like it, Scorpio. I like it. So for some of you, there's this new intense energy after going through a challenge challenging time or a separation where within the next week to two weeks you will be feeling this energy or getting this energy back getting your sexy back right as JT would say <laughs> yeah. all right uh, what other messages do we have for my lovely Scorpios what other messages spirit do we have for my lovely Scorpios What messages do we have for my Scorpios? Of 
gratitude. I notice and appreciate my blessings and I open the door to more of God's gifts. Amen. I couldn't say this any louder. So when you're gratitude, gratitude, I'm grateful. I'm grateful for my life today. I'm grateful for the opportunity. I'm grateful for everything, even if it's a meal, if it's a roof, it's anything to be grateful for. This is a beautiful energy to stay in, Scorpio. I love it. I got to do it myself, right? So every day, right? No matter what's going on, the challenges that I'm facing, I am also chasing them with a great deal of gratitude towards what I do have in my life and have been able to have and still enjoy in life right now, okay? So super, super important. I love seeing that coming out for you guys. What other messages do we have for my lovely Scorpios? I keep looking at this GPS trying to find you. Somebody could be trying to locate you and not know how to find you, connect with you. They could be looking for a phone number. Um, it could be a family member, okay? I pray for family and to give this situation over to God for answer, support, and healing. So there could be a family situation too where you could be struggling, right? Like not all family is family and that's sad and unfortunate, but it is just life, right? So some of us have had to deal with situations where you could be dealing with a situation where not all family is family, right? So having to Pray to God um, and give this situation over to the universe or God for support and help and healing, right? So if there is this energy of feeling like you can't depend on family right now or whatever, give the situation over to the universe, to God. Um, and I do believe that you will be taken care of, right? You know, or provided, you know, what, whatever it might be, whether it's a soul tribe, a soul connection, a new soul mate. You know, I do believe that people are also put into our lives, in certain points and times in our lives to help us make it through, to help us guide, be guided in a certain direction, whatever it might be, Scorpio, just believe here that there is hope. I trust that God has a wonderful solution and brilliant, excuse me, brilliant plans for me in store. So just don't lose sight of hope right now with whatever's going on in your situation. Hope is super, super important. Trust me, I get it. And that's the biggest battle with, you know, everything that I've been going through too. It's just you got to stay um, full of hope, right? So what other messages do we have for Scorpio? Coming in. Solid foundation, solidness. This came out before. I feel like this is extra confirmation. Like whatever you are doing right now, you are currently building solidness, whether it's within a relationship, whether it's in a business, whatever it is that you're doing, whether it's work, friendships, there's solidness here. There's solid foundations. You're building something that is rock solid, Scorpio. I like that. All right. Mm. Excuse me, what other messages do we have for Scorpio? Inspiration, holy one. Wow. So some of you are feeling really, really inspired or this energy, there could be an energy around you that feels very inspirational or there's this just inspirational energy that's being inspired by, it says, holy one, by spirit, by universe, by being provided what you need, right? By communicating with source, right? By, by being vulnerable with source, right? By crying, by, 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 you know, for all the things, right? It's like, I feel like holding on and letting source guide you through these challenges here. This is holy one. This is inspiration. This is what is actually the rock solid bottom of this foundation here. Okay. And it couldn't be even for me, that is absolutely it. Right. So when you have nobody else, Scorpio, what do you have? Right. This inspiration, this solidness, this rock solid foundation. Right. So when everything else crumbles, you still have this. Right. And you still are going to be, you know, taken care of. I love it. 
um, hope is the key, right? What do they say? Hope the size of a mustard seed, right? Can get you so far. So what other messages can, uh, do we have for Scorpio? A lot of you, um, again, look, have some type of connection here. Either you have some type of craftsmanship, something that you're good at, or you're connecting with somebody that has some type of craftsmanship or they use their hands to create something. We've also got healer energy and a mentor. So some of you that are healers have an energy around you or that could have an energy around you within the next week to two weeks, whatever you're doing, that is actually a mentor. This is somebody that has shown up in your life. Um, this could be somebody that has some type of craftsmanship. They could create something, um, a healer. They could, uh, you know, create some type of um, uh, what, uh, what am I trying, what am I thinking of right now? Like dream catchers or some type of like spiritual craftsmanship or something. There's healership here. There's a coach. There's somebody coming into your life that's actually helping you through some type of shadow work, 11, 11 and 111 as soon as I've said that. So you have actually manifested this, look, communicating with the divine messages, right? Um, some type of healing um, soulmate energy into your life, Scorpio. What other messages do we have with the angel tarot? What other messages do we have with the angel tarot? I feel like for some of you, there's like you're re you're looking back and feeling like there was some type of energy vampire or some type of succubus sucking sucking <laughs> sucking energy whatever that is Scorpio with the knight of cups yeah this is revelation perception seeing something like you're being given messages from the divine here um this says revealing God it's funny that I was like tripping over my words and saying that but that's funny but this is also it's like you know uh you're being shown some of you are if you've been in loveless situations or situations where you were played third party it's almost like you're being shown what romance and what love and how somebody is supposed to treat someone is it's actually you're going to be shown this so there's going to be a perception shift here that's going to be like okay I can't really ignore this right so I like that that's coming up and the, the spirit is going to be giving you and communicating with you this message right so it's kind of going to be one of those things that's undeniable Scorpio um I like it what other messages do we have page of wands if you've been going through people stalking you watching you talking shit about you scorpio this is all um god preventing something from happening i feel like there could have been a plan here your angels are kind of helping protect here with this energy coming out there could have been some type of plan uh, against you or in regards to you that has been stopped there's also the something here showing up that has to do with messages here okay i like because these can also be fun flirty messages what is the page of wands energy i'm also getting the the you know confounds the wicked and slander saves from enemies somebody was talking a lot of shit and trying to it could have even been like um talking a lot of shit trying to get a um what is it like a rally up against you or a smear campaign, right? Uh, I feel like somebody's been busted. Whatever this is, it's like somebody's embarrassed now. Here, there's something embarrassing coming out. Yeah, here's the full card with a fresh start. So it's like you're you're able to walk away um, with a fresh start in regards to whatever this might be. Um, the Knight of Wands with the Eight of Wands. Excuse me, it fell on the floor over there. I promise you that it. That's what it is. You're going to be getting communication here in regards to um somebody that you've taken a break from. This is a player. Four of Swords. Uh, the magician here. Somebody could be trying to manipulate a situation, whether it's a vacation, a get together here. Uh, eight of pentacles uh, coming together saying they want to work with you Scorpio so it does look like there is an option here coming in two of cups this person is like soulmate energy two of cups this is a soulmate but this is also somebody I feel like that's been a runner an opportunity somebody ran in a direction let's clarify where they saw an opportunity and they felt like you uh, yeah 
uh, weren't good enough. I don't like this, Scorpio. Could have been dealing with an Aquarius or somebody that had some kind of clout here. Star chasing energy. The King of Swords, though, there was some type of plan. There was some type of plan here for somebody. They felt like, yeah, there's the Queen of Wands. Somebody was attractive. There was this energy of an opportunity. Somebody could have been a very attractive and selling a good story here. Yep. <laughs> this person could have also been younger. So there again, there could have been a lot of elements here. Yeah, but with the Queen of Pentacles, wow. Somebody was lying about their age here. They were lying about a lot. Just to get that Ten of Cups, somebody was portraying like this Empress energy vibe and they were not. If the truth has come out with whatever that was, Scorpio. Again, it could have been a workplace. Did we have workplace? Yeah, affair. So again, some type of workplace affair that went sour. Again, somebody met, had a good, it's like they, they, they have a good representative judgment. Yeah, somebody has, there's definitely been some level of karma in regards to some type of control in a situation. And Knight of Cups in a romantic situation. Seven of Swords, there were lies here in a situation. Seven of Swords wanted to come out again, so confirmation. Why are we in this energy, Six of Wands? Because it wasn't successful. It's not going to be successful. The Queen of Cups, you're moving in a direction where you are, male or female. This is opening up to a new relationship romantically. Hierophant energy, this is the Empress. I'm enjoying my life. Um, Hierophant doesn't have to be marriage, but this can be more of a traditional connection. So if we're stepping away from things that weren't successful, in the past where people were juggling where there were third party situations there was a painful ending here i feel like you're basically yeah that's kind of how it felt like i'm just i'm done i'm throwing my cards all on the table here uh what other messages can you tell us for scorpio things keep <laughs> it might be time to quit all right scorpio Moving forward, you've got an opportunity here. You're going to have to do some soul searching in regards to. This does look like it has to do with money, working, collaborating with someone here. Um, the Seven of Swords, I don't like that that's coming out. There could be a lie here uh, that you're going to end up regretting. So just be careful in making some decisions. Really do some soul searching in regards to teamwork, working together. Uh there's going to be a happy outcome to a situation here where things are coming to light. We do have the sun and the moon together. So when they do come out together, it's like, well, things come out. They came out for a reason, Scorpio. So the good things could also be exposed or, you know, uh, the good can be seen also in your life at the same time. Okay, so... Five of Wands, there's that drama. Knight of Wands, somebody brought a lot of drama. That is over. High Priestess, Eight of Cups, you've walked away. You've trusted your intuition. This person is still watching and stressing. With the Ace of Pentacles, um, I feel like releasing this negativity here. Here's the Death card, Scorpio Energy. And then we've got the Ace of Pentacles, which has come out three times in a row in three different readings today for you guys. Um divine blessings when it comes to money right it's doing the inner and the outer work and having the strength to continue to move forward here okay i feel like a lot of you are making transformations and changes in your life that are actually bringing in yeah divine and this is it's also connected to to confidence here's the queen of wands a new level of confidence scorpio i feel like and this is divine power right understanding your power this confidence and regardless of what happens what you are capable of doing and receiving in your life so scorpio i hope this message was helpful Again, like I said, I'm going to get some personals done, get a little exercise and come back for a live. Hopefully it's not too late. I hope this message was helpful. If somebody would like to donate, please do. If you uh, would like reading donations, all that information, Venmo Cash App, GoFundMe is in the description box below. I love you guys so much. Until next time, bye.